Here we have the all new 2024 Chevrolet Trax. Now this Trax comes in the 1RS trim level in mosaic black metallic. And then we have jet black with gray cloth interior. The powertrain consists of a 1.2 liter turbocharged three cylinder engine. That's made it to a six speed automatic transmission. And I'm gonna go over all the features of this Trax and show you all why I think this is one of the best buys that you can get right now in a compact SUV. As you come around to the front end here, love the front styling here. Really does remind me of the new Blazers, just how the, the front end set up. We have LED headlamps there. I love that the grill, you don't see any black plastic here, which is very surprising. All of this is gloss black or kind of like that gray finish. It just, it looks so good. Now around to the wheels here, these are 18 inch machine alloy wheels. They look fantastic as well. I love the color combos there. If you're interested in the tire specs, Now, to the door panel here, we get power door lock controls. We have one touch down on all four windows. Rear window lock there, then power mirror controls are here. But what's awesome is we get these blind spot monitors. And I'll show you what package is part of and show you again why this is such a good deal. The bottle holder here. Now, we do only get four speakers for the whole vehicle, but no surprise there. Headlamp controls are there. We can toggle our auto mode on or off there. Love the red accents throughout, especially around the vents and all that. And then we have a manual driver's seat, but it is six way. So we can move the seat back and forth, the seat back up and down. And then we can move the seat bottom. We can toggle that up and down there. Big shout out to Chevrolet Buick GMC of Murfreesboro for letting me review this track today. I'll leave a link below in the description for it. I'm gonna try and go through all this. Hopefully you all can see it. Pause anywhere you need to. Now I will say with this RS, the standard features on here are crazy. Getting the heated front seats, a heated steering wheel. Then of course we get the Chevy safety assist, all those standard features. And then the driver confidence package, it's only 250 bucks, but we get that lane change alert with the side blind zone. So only 23, 445 for this car is nuts but i have the seat up front adjusted for someone of my size being six foot three so let's go ahead and check out this rear leg room so quite impressive actually very very surprised by this knees aren't even touching the back of the seat here now i do have it in my driving position so i tend to have my seat back up but i mean my goodness just crazy room for this to be such a small vehicle now we don't have seat back pockets, so there's missing storage there, but we do have a nice, a pretty deep storage pocket here if a rear passenger wants to stick their phone or something in there. Here's a view of the front from back here. And we also don't have a rear seat that folds down, but I mean, for this price point, you can pretty much expect that. I do like that we have the hangar though. So this would be a great car for commuters until you have do a lot of business travel, you're getting 32 miles per gallon on the highway, and you can hang your shirts back here. Let's go ahead and make our way to the back. For those that are curious, fuel filler there. Now, as we come around to the back end here, we don't get the LED tail lamps, but that's an easy swap. If you want to just put LED bulbs in, they won't be like a full on LED tail light, but the lights will be bright enough for you. And I have a sponsor, I use Auto One. They actually provide those for me. I put them in like an old 2004 Tundra I have and it gets the job done without having to get all new tail lamps and all that. But there's a space behind the second row, pretty good size. And I love that we have the storage pocket on this side if we wanna keep stuff in the back, but we don't want it rolling around while we're driving. I can get this, there's a spare tire underneath there. So for those of you that are tired of manufacturers putting inflator kits in vehicles, you do get a spare with this one. And then here, we can fold this seat flat either side, run longer objects through to the front. And just make sure the seat belt's out the way, lock it back into place. And then our anchors are hidden right here in that crack. And 
and then there is our front passenger seat and then we can fold that up that far and then move the seat back or move the whole seat back and forth there very impressed by this trim it looks very sporty it, it looks like it belongs in a track rx rs excuse me very nice look there Now I did forget to pop the hood, so I'm gonna go back around, show you where that latch is, and then we'll take a look underneath it. Then you just pull right here to the right. And there's that 1.2 liter three cylinder, turbocharged. But next, let's go ahead and hop in the driver's seat and see what features we have there. So we do get a manual tilt telescoping steering wheel there. There's the horn sound. Now to the radio, we do get AM, FM, XM along with Bluetooth. And then we still have CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility there settings all of that's here language can be changed then phone connections go in there add phone walks you right through it just find the bluetooth settings on your device and then we do get a rear seat reminder and teen driver here as well and then we have that wi-fi hotspot so a very simple system which i actually like about this car because it is a, a twenty-four thousand dollar vehicle volume just turn up or down there and you can click the power button to mute and then hold it to power the whole system down and then you do have a home button that's an actual button which is nice as well backup cameras there we do have the guidelines that follow us we turn the steering wheel pretty good picture i believe that's hd we can turn the guidelines on or off there hazards are here and then for our ac controls we can toggle the ac there temperature can be adjusted here fan speed here and fan direction here Click there for the rear defroster and then click here to close the vents off. And then we also have those standard three-stage heated front seats. USB-C, USB-A port there, 12 volt. And then with your standard Chevy safety assist, you do get the lane keeping system with lane departure. We can toggle there. And then we have the auto stop toggle here. One of my favorite things about this track is we do get a traditional transmission. So we have a six-speed auto, pull the lever, reverse neutral drive, and you have that gear limiter there and you can toggle what gear you're in and it'll show you where you are in the bottom right corner of the digital gauge cluster and again you can just toggle up and down there electronic parking brake pull up to engage hit the brake press down to disengage center console cubby space there's a view of the back from up here on star let's see we don't have a light here, so I was expecting that, but it's whatever. Now back to the steering wheel, behind, blinkers are here. And then we can toggle our gauge cluster by using this. And then you can go between either menu or submenu there and toggle all that. So I'll just go quickly through. And then here you can actually toggle your units from US to metric. So, it's kind of weird. You use this button on the side to actually, like an enter button, and then you use this to just go through those sub menus there. So I like that everything is, everything that I would want in a vehicle like this is there. And then blinkers here. And then if you're in the auto mode, you have your auto high beams and you can toggle that. And then when your low beams are on, you can toggle the high beams there and then flash that way. And then windshield wiper controls, one time, off, intermittent, low, high. You can adjust the intermittent wipers here. And then you have a rear wiper off, intermittent on there. And then push back for the rear wiper fluid, pull up for the front wiper fluid. Cruise control toggles here. You can adjust speed, cancel, forward collision alert, gap adjust, that heated steering wheel toggle. And then you have voice recognition, mute. And I like how they did this here. You can adjust your volume up or down here and then go through your radio station presets by toggling these favorite buttons here. And then we do have a turnkey, but it does come with remote start. If 
But next is go ahead and take this 2024 Trax 1RS out on the road for a test drive.